What's up, y'all? It's your girlfriend, Seska. I haven't really been sharing with you guys, you know, me getting my apartment ready here in Atlanta because it's been a lot. Like, adjusting to everything and getting my life on track, y'all, it took me personally a little bit. I am still organizing my apartment. I'm still getting everything nice, so you haven't missed out on anything. We are actually just getting started. I have this really dope thing that I bought, and I want to put it together, and I want y'all to see. It's really, really cool, and it's like more than a gadget because it's like really big, I guess. I didn't expect it to be this big. Anyways. It's getting late. It's like almost past my bedtime for real. I got to finish organizing my dining room. And it's gonna definitely look different than this when I'm finished. So y'all stay tuned for what I got planned in my head, okay? But for right now, we're gonna put together this behind the door store. It's really industrial. Like this thing, it will carry a lot of products. If you are struggling with living in like, you know, a smaller area than you probably would need for your things, your stuff ends up being messy and all over the place. But this right here, this is gonna change my life. And I'm so happy that I found it. I'm so grateful to God that I found this item so that I can put my things away really, really organized, really, really neatly, and also be able to store a lot of things in this thing. So without further ado, let's go ahead and put it together. Something about your hands on my body is better than See, it comes with these bins. Look at how big these bins are, y'all. This is gonna go behind my door. I'm gonna be able to products and natural hair girls. Y'all know, y'all know how us how we be. We got so much stuff. We have so much products. Even if it's like just skincare products and lotions and body washes and conditioners and yeah, if you only got just one cabinet in your bathroom and you don't have a freaking linen closet even and you you need some storage, okay? You need storage options. You need secret hidden storage options that will help save your life and transform your space. Here's one of them. Let's see. It's a picture? It got pictures? Okay. It must not be that hard then if it has just pictures for me to like look at. These just have like a little clip on the back. Real industrial clips though. Four metal clips to go in four of these holes. So you can choose how do you want to glow? How do you want to glow? Stack it up like glow. Do you want to space glow? Do you want to space it out? Glow. And you don't have to get six of these. You can actually get other storage options. They have like cubbies and compartments and things where you can put sticky notes and pin things. But me personally... I need bins. I need all the bins I can get so I can put things in it and have space. So I got six of these. Can boom. Look at how easy that was. Look how easy that was. So that's one. And if you want to take it out, boom, you can take it out. But it's very sturdy. So I got that part. But I need to know how to hook it onto the door because ain't no more directions on here. So I'm supposed to just it's not even any words, y'all. It's just a bunch of pictures. It says, put this part of the hook. Okay, well, this is gonna go. All I have to do is just growl, keep it a stack, growl, put a machine in the back. That's all I gotta do for the bottom. And then for the top, that's the one where you need the Allen wrench to adjust just in case your door is different sizes. You can adjust, boom, the top. I already got it. I don't need these anymore. Go ahead and put the bins in the way that I want to. They definitely look smaller against the door. So this is gonna be so good. Like I actually think I'm gonna put my face wash here. Cause I'm always fighting coming under the cabinet. Now I'm just gonna be like. <laughs> 
face wash. Boop. I literally just lay them in there. So I'm really, really happy. I like to just go ahead and organize it so that the next day when I wake up, I really feel accomplished. Like I woke up in the further dimension of who I wanted to be. It's like, I would much rather get it done tonight. You see how much space I was wasting prior? Like, this door was first of all always open. Now I can use all this space and I'm really, really happy about it. Let me tell you something about God. He is good. I'm gonna take these little stickers off. Todd, can you play that again? The container storage behind the door has really helped with the spacing. I have a lot more space now. And it's a blessing when you live by yourself. I think everybody should experience living by themselves. It really is a test to see if you can really stay on your shit alone. And I want my stuff to always be on point so that I can have a space that is conducive to the habits that I'm trying to create. Organizing your life ensuring that you feel good in your space because if you wake up to a productive space like everything's set up and that's what you want to do set yourself up for success you want to invest in yourself as well you can do many things in a day because at work right you're eight hours non-stop they're on your ass all through the day making sure that you do those things making sure you stay organized making sure that you put these files over here did you do this did you do this you have to do it otherwise you will not get paid and these are the types of things that you have to remember for yourself you sometimes can't even be on your phone because your boss gonna be like, what are you doing on your phone? Did you ask to make that phone call? It's like, damn, I can't even fucking look. But I sent you on your phone. 
Anyway, we're not going to go there, but you're not going to go there. If your manager was to come into your house to be the manager now of those goals that you know you have to do, how would you act? Like, it made me better. And then I realized I need to be on my own ass at home to make me better so that I can grow and do the things I need to do. I'd rather go to sleep later if it means I will go to sleep proud of the things that I have accomplished that day so that the next day I can wake up like five more steps ahead. It don't even have to be five sometimes. Some days it's just two things getting done or three. But as long as you're stepping forward every day, by the time you know it, you'll look back and you're like, I came a long way. Like, I didn't have to put those steps forward. I could have kept procrastinating. I could have just not have listened to my intuition that's been crying out to me for a long time now. What we going to do? Hey, what we going to do? What we going to do? Hey, hey, hey. Ain't no more waiting. The time has come and the time is now. But I want you, so keep pulling me closer. Keep pulling me closer. You get me excited, can't imagine what my body would do. With a whole night with you, with you, I feel recharged.